Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi. I would love for you to subscribe and stick around and be a part of my family. I did shop at ASOS, Three Little Thing, Princess Polly, a few boots from Macy's, and Zara. So without further ado, let's just jump right into it. I'm going to go by category because I think that is the most exciting, which is jackets. I got two coats because I generally, for the life of me, couldn't really decide on which one I wanted. I just like saw both of them and absolutely fell in love with both of them although they're very similar i think they are both just stunning the first one is this brown trench coat it's not a trench coat it's just the coat i have this coat in a black color but this chocolate color is just absolutely stunning if you know me i love browns so when i saw this coat i had to grab it this coat is actually very 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 long this coat is meant to hit you at your ankle which i think kind of elevates the whole like look and makes the coat look a lot more expensive i got it in a us size 4 if you are curious about your size this coat is meant to be on the oversized side so i would maybe stick with your normal size and if anything if you want you can also kind of go down a size but love 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 this coat it does have two pockets on the side it is double breasted which i don't really care because i don't think i will ever kind of close it and yeah this is how it kind of looks like from the back just very simple i just really like the silhouette of it being super long and then the color is just stunning the second coat is honestly very similar to the first one i showed you so you don't have to like buy both i just really couldn't make up my mind on which one i really liked more and this one is on sale so i just decided to pick it up it is actually by the brand pull and bear which i don't think this brand is in the us but i'm pretty sure it's very popular in europe but i loved the color of this again it's like that brown color but this one is more of like orange burnt orange brown color and i love that this one is a regular length so it doesn't really hit you like very very long this coat i got it in the us size small yeah it honestly kind of looks the same the only thing is that it does have pockets but it doesn't have the little flap that go on the pocket it's just a scoop low deep um pocket on the side this one was more of casual i can throw this on and i can go like whack my dog just felt a little bit more laid back versus the other one just gives me a little bit of more of an elevation of a coat and i got two more from pretty little thing so i'm going to show you those again they're both very very similar couldn't really decide on which color to get so the first one is this teddy bear kind of teddy bear teddy coat and if you have seen i think pretty little thing is like known for this coat i have seen it everywhere on pinterest i've been eyeing a coat like this since last year i've seen so many outfits on pinterest of girlies wearing this coat and it looks absolutely stunning so i really wanted one that is like a little bit more oversized drop shoulder um and i really wanted it in the brown color it is long but it does hit at your kind of calves midway of your calves and it has pockets again i love her she is so chunky this is a blanket you guys like if i'm cold even in the house i am whipping this baby up and i'm just like bundling in it it is so so comfortable and so warm this coat i got it in us size 6 on pinterest i saw more girlies wearing the same coat but in this like white color and i kind of not white but like cream and this one was a little bit different it doesn't have the drop shoulders and it's not as kind of like chunky like the little this area is not as big and it doesn't have like the drop shoulders on it but it does have this like chunkiness feel to it again very very warm and yeah so i have like kind of the same coat in two different colors which i think is excessive but i love both of them i got it in size us 6 that's all the coats that i got i'm gonna show you everything that i got from asos i did get one top and a few accessories starting with the top it's very very simple i got this bodysuit it has this like 
really really small like, kind of turtleneck it's not really a full turtleneck it just kind of like gives you a little bit of a peak and it is a bodysuit version i can never get enough of tops like this something black long sleeve and it has a little bit of a turtleneck like you always need a top like this I have a few and I thought a bodysuit is definitely a must. It's made out of really really good material. I'm really really happy with it. For reference, I did get this in a size 4. And I got a few accessories. The first thing is this cute little beanie. It says skier on it and I thought this was so cute to kind of wear it going skiing or on snowy days i just really like how it's like stripey and it is in this like powder pink color i thought it's just like so so fun i got rid of all of my belts i have been working on kind of renovating my belt collection so i got rid of all of my old belts and i'm kind of just like buying new ones that are going to be staples so i got this belt from asos i thought this like square gold buckle black belt is just like very very simple but the shape of the belt or the buckle kind of just elevates it so i ended up picking this one up i'm not gonna lie the belt itself it feels like it's made out of really really cheap material like i feel like this will definitely fall apart so so quickly so just keep that in mind i got this one in a us four to six and lastly i ended up getting this i think this one is called snood if i am not mistaken you can add it to your outfit and you can wear it around your neck just to kind of give your neck a little bit of warmth i thought this was perfect to wear going skiing or like even on snow days and i want something a little bit extra and just a little bit more warm so I ended up picking this one up. I also like the color. It's just like such a beautiful pink. So I'm excited. I don't really have anything in my closet like this. From Pretty Little Thing, I got these two coats that I showed you. I also got one more thing and it is this jogger. I feel like you can never have enough gray joggers and I like the simplicity of this one. It has the Pretty Little Thing kind of stitching on it. And yeah, I just thought it was like really, really simple. I needed one more gray jogger for the winter time. And this one is pretty, pretty nice. I got mine in a US size six. I think this one was almost like sold out when I first picked it up, but if it is in stock, I will kind of link it and I'll link everything else. Next place I shopped at is Zara. The first piece is what I'm wearing right now. This top actually went viral. One girl talked about how this was a dupe to the Skims Fits Every Body Top and I was skeptic and I really wanted to see it for myself so I ended up picking it up in this like brown color and I gotta say it is actually really not a dupe. It is a good top but it's not like the same material. This one gives me more of like Spanx material if that makes any sense. Like it's not as stretchy as the Skims one, but I still love it. It is very, very smoothing. It is such a gorgeous color. I love it. And I think it was not that expensive either. So I think this will be such a good top to kind of layer with. And for reference, I got this one in a size small. The next thing I got from Zara is this cropped top. It's actually made out of sweater material i don't know if you can tell but it is short sleeves and that's the reason why i picked it up it's just like the combination of short sleeves but also a turtleneck and a sweater material was just different and i really really liked the color of it i got this one in a size small one thing about this though it is very very cropped i think it hit me at like right below my breast so just keep that in mind, it is very, very cropped, so you might have to wear like a very high-waisted jeans with it, but I really like the material of it. It's very, very stretchy, and I think the material is such a good quality as well. I saved best for last. You guys are gonna go crazy over this top. I think it's stunning. I am so happy I picked it up, but it is in this black long sleeve top it's gonna be very hard to show you but i did film a try on portion so you'll be able to tell how this looks on but this top has this like 
opening at the shoulders it shows a part of your left shoulder and it does have a little bit of a peekaboo turtleneck style and it is long sleeves i have never seen a top in that style i think it's just stunning you can wear it to go out it's just it's stunning i think it's one of those cute tops that you don't really see anyone wear out there. I did pick a few things from Princess Bali. Like I said, I have been trying to revamp my belt collection and I found this belt from Princess Bali. I gotta say this belt is way better quality than the ASOS one. So if you want to splurge a little bit on the belt, I'll definitely pick this one up. I just like how simple it is. It's black with a gold buckle. The buckle has this like really funky shape, which I like. It's a little bit different than your normal standard round uh, buckle. So I really like that about it. But the quality is honestly insane. Like I, it's just the leather feels so smooth. This belt will definitely last a long time. So I'm really, really happy I picked this one up. I have been loving wearing bodysuits lately. And I saw a girl wear a bodysuit or a top that had such a low back. And it was long sleeves. And I thought that was such a cute like top to have so i found one that was very very similar on princess polly and it is basically this like black long sleeve bodysuit it looks very very simple from the front you know it's just like your typical long sleeve top but it has a complete open bag and it goes as low as your lower bag i thought that was just like such a cute kind of like sexy spin on just like a simple black bodysuit i did get this one in a size two i would say this bodysuit had such like all over the place reviews on princess bali a lot of people said that it didn't fit them that well and some people said that the shoulders or the sleeves kept falling off and i think that might be because this top is so insanely stretchy so if you stick to your normal size or even if you go one size down I think you might run into that issue that's why i did go with two sizes down i got this one in a us2 which i don't think i have any piece of clothing that is us2 that's how insane the stretch on this bodysuit so just to avoid the sleeves from falling off because the sleeves kind of just hold on to nothing because the back is completely open so as long as it is like fitting you very well the sleeves shouldn't fall off and the US2 fits me very, very well. I like the fact that it does have like kind of like a minimal underwear part because I hate like panty lines. So I love this. I think this is such a cute bodysuit also for evening or going out. The reason why I placed this Princess Polly order is because again, it's just similar to my kind of like intent to revamp my belt collection. I'm also trying to revamp my scarf collection, especially like knit chunky scarves. I had a lot of scarves but they were very, very 2015. I wanted to just get new ones, ones that look really, really modern and really nice. So I ended up seeing this one on Princess Bali. It is this like white cream chunky knit scarf. And you guys, you know those Instagram models that post on their Instagram in the middle of the snow? They're all bundled up and they look really, really cute. And they have like such a big knit scarf on and they're all wearing like white or cream outfits this is what this scarf gives me it just i love how chunky how big it is but also the color of the white like especially with the cream teddy bear coat that i just showed you i think will be such a cute little outfit i just love her she is so so cute I think this will be such a staple in my scarf collection because you can never go wrong with a scarf like this. It will never like be outdated or go out of style. And then I needed to pick something else up because I refused to pay for shipping. So I ended up picking this dress up because it was on sale and I have been eyeing it for a while but I didn't really have the need to pick it up. But when I saw that it was on sale, I was like, it's the perfect time. So I ended up picking it up. This is, I think, called... This is called the Star Power Mini Dress in Black. And I got the tall version. This dress comes in tall, 
petite and regular i ended up getting the tall version because all of the comments on this dress were saying that this dress is so short so i ended up just going with the tall version just to avoid that problem and for reference i got mine in a us 8 because this one is made out of material that doesn't stretch and i really really didn't want it to be super tight on me so it's gonna be probably more on the flowy side but we will see how this one fits like i pretty much don't really have any more clothes to show you but i do have two more shoes to show you if you follow me on instagram which you probably should you probably have already seen these boots i did talk about them on my instagram for people who don't follow me on instagram because i think these boots are stunning and i think they are priced very very right these two boots that i'm about to show you are both made out of the same brand which is madden girl it's just like simple chunky black boots especially those ones that are kind of like over the knee or right below the knee i think are going to be just so cute to kind of like elevate your outfits and just like make it look a little bit more um put together i just love love this one i think it's so comfortable the amazing thing about this boot it does come in wide calf if you have the same problem like me where boots normally just don't fit your calves because you have muscular or big calves definitely this will fix the issue i got mine in white calf and they are huge on my calves and they look really really good so love these i got them in my normal size and then the second pair of boots are these light cream strappy or not strappy i don't know what these are called lacy lacy strappy lacy boots the reason why i picked up this boot is because i had a specific outfit in mind that i really wanted to recreate and it was basically the white scarf with the cream teddy jacket with a chromatic white or cream top and pants and this boot on just it will be an absolutely chef's kiss of an outfit so had to pick these boots up i also think that they are gorgeous with joggers like the gray jogger that i showed you and then like maybe a sweater on top or just like a simple long sleeve top i feel like this boot can just go with so many different things in my wardrobe but yeah that's everything that i got i hope you guys liked today's video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys on my next video bye guys